All right. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. I hope you're doing well. And welcome to this um, smoothie bowl tutorial. Um, so my name is Tammy Rulo. This morning I'm going to show you how I make my smoothie bowls every single day. Now, I was one of those who never had breakfast in the morning. I hated waking up and having breakfast. And But about two years ago, I discovered um, this anti-inflammatory uh, nutrition and I fell in love with eating smooth bowls every single day. And now I can tell you honestly that I really look forward to that because I can make them however I want. Each day is different. So here we go. Super simple. Step one, choose the fruit that you're gonna put in. I say fruit, but you can also put in vegetables, right? You can use kale, you can use spinach. Um, you can make a nice green smoothie. So with uh, grapes, with apples, and it's super, super rich in fiber, uh, super rich in vitamins. This morning, today's Friday, I'm feeling a little bit like on holidays, so we're going with the tropical feel. So I'm gonna put banana, uh, I have pineapple, I have mango, passion fruit, and dragon fruit. So, and I like to use a uh, frozen fruit because it makes a really cold smoothie bowl. I love it cold. And when you choose your fruit, guys, you have to be careful. If you don't know about the Dirty Dozen, the Clean 15, um, Google it, check it out. The Dirty Dozen is the 12, um, 12 fruits, 12 vegetables that have the higher risk of pesticides in them. So you want to tend to go uh, towards organic in those. So in those you have, for example, um, you have strawberries, apples, grapes, um, things like that. And then you have the Clean 15, and those are really okay to buy wherever they don't have to be organic so things like uh, broccoli like um, avocado there's kiwi pineapple as well so super good for you so the two things that you can choose every day depending on your mood are the fruit or the vegetables and i like to use um arbon uh, protein powder this is all vegan so rice pea and cranberry protein Super, super easy to digest, helps in uh, rebuilding muscle tissue, helps in rebuilding blood cells, so it's super good. And it comes in um, vanilla, chocolate, cinnamon bun, marble cake, and last night we just launched uh, strawberry as well. So I love this, you have 20 grams of vegan protein in every serving, so two scoops. And you also have 20 vitamins and minerals. So it's packed with good stuff, and it tastes really, really good. I, I didn't know about protein before, but I have a lot of friends that did, and that tried all kinds of different, of different ones, and they really say that this one tastes the best. These are the three things that I put in that are non-negotiable every single day. So I have my fiber boost here. Um, the daily recommended dose is, or dose, intake is about uh, 25 grams. And in one serving of this fiber boost, we get 12 grams. So soluble fibers that really help um, in digestion. I love that. Then I have probiotics, prebiotics, and enzymes all in one in this little package. It comes in a box like this with 30 packages. So uh, probiotics for your gut health. Really, you want to maintain that for uh, your your immune system, uh, you have prebiotics that will go and feed the good bacteria. You have trillions of bacteria in your body and you wanna feed the good ones. And the enzymes are gonna help you digest and break down food and help you assimilate them better. So I love having this every day. And the magic ingredient in a smoothie bowl, which makes it different than a regular smoothie, is the avocado. So what this is gonna do, this is a superfood. So it's super, super rich in, uh, in vitamins, super rich in potassium, more than a banana, really good for you. And what it's gonna do in a smoothie bowl is change the consistency. It's gonna make it like a, like a, like a pudding. And it's so good, it makes it so rich. So here we go, I have everything in there. Now I need my milk. Today I'm gonna use oat milk. I really like to use plant-based milk because um, dairy is super, super inflammatory, so you'll, your skin might react, you're, you might be bloated with dairy. So in our house, we've switched to um, plant-based 
um, milk. So today, oat, we can use almond, cashew milk. Just put that in there. Well, send it for a bit of a blend. Let's check it out. I love this smoothie. It makes me think of a pina colada. It makes me feel like I'm on vacation. So here we go. So you see how it's like, it's really silky and smooth and it's like, it's really like a pudding. If you want it thicker, just um, don't put in as much milk. And then the fun part is decorating your smoothie bowl. It's super fun to do with kids. It tastes really good. And the kids can really use their imagination when it comes to um, decorating their smoothie bowls or adding any toppings that they want. So today I will put a strawberry. So really for the artist, the artist in you, just any way that you want to make it pretty because we eat with our eyes, right? So anything that's pretty, you will want to eat. There you go. And then I also like to add um, either walnuts or any kind of seed, like flax seed, pumpkin seed, uh, hemp hearts. I have coconut, I have almond slithers. So anything at all that, um, that you want to put on there today, I'm going to put, here, we'll go with pumpkin seeds. And since we're going tropical, I'm going to go with coconut. And there you go. Super simple. Let me come up and show you. Super simple, super hearty, super healthy. And really, I'm telling you, you won't be hungry. You won't be hungry until many, many hours later. It's super filling, super healthy for you. So. Enjoy, have a good breakfast, and don't hesitate if you have any questions at all. Bye, guys.